Welcome to International Microbiome and Diagnostic Forum IMDR 2022. My name is Muhammad Hairo Muhammad Saleh and my supervisor is Associate Professor Dr. Yuzin Iser. We are from Department of Aquaculture, Faculty of Agriculture, University of Putra, Malaysia. This is the research title and we collaborate with four agencies. Introduction Batagor Afini, Southern River Trapin, or locally known as Tuntong Sungai, in Peninsular Malaysia, found two Batagor Afini subspecies. Batagor Afini Afinis, found in west coast of Peninsular Malaysia, and Batagor Afini Sakwekmoni found in east coast of Peninsular Malaysia. Why Southern River Drapin? Because of four factors totally protected in Malaysian Wildlife Conservation Act 2010 and top 25 freshwater turtle endangered species, critically endangered listed by IUCN Red List, and most endangered species by CITES in Appendix 5. Problem statement decreasing in number of Batago Afinis population in Peninsular Malaysia, and the hypothesis may be cut microbiome affect their survival rate. The objective of this study to characterize and compare the fecal bacteria between captive and wild Patagor Afinis in Peninsular Malaysia using NGS meta barcoding and the novelty is this is the first study on fecal DNA meta barcoding of Patagor Afinis in Duo. Materials and Methods We have two study sites, Bota Kanan and also Bukit Palo. The Bota Kanan contains five sample Batagor Afinis Afinis and Bukit Palo Kuala Buran Trunganu got two sample Batagor Afinis at Wormoli Fikers. Sixteen as Ambikan preparation workflow. In total, we have eleven steps, and we focus on V three, V four regions. Further analyze, we use Silva and Dada two pipelines. So this is the workflow. For the CCNS applicant library preparation. Results Sequencing results from non hemoric to filtered in total 420,000 bacteria. Alpha diversity, we used two indices, Chalk 1 and Shannon. BK means Bota Kanan, the captive sample, and KBW is Kuala Brown well sample. The highest alpha diversity is came from sample Bota Kanan 31st. This figure shows captive beta diversity more higher than the wild sample.
This data shows about the taxonomy from Pila to genera, and actually, in total, we determine 297 bacteria communities. This graph shows the result from bacterial taxonomic profile analysis. Vermin cute is the highest phylum for captive and wild sample. Meanwhile, Cytobacterium is the highest genus found in captive sample and Ackermansia the highest genus in wild sample. Overall, Fermincute contain 38.69% and genus Cytobacterium contain 67.79%. From the pie chart, shows 25% bacteria can cause some diseases and 75% promoting healthier life. Discussion Most abundant pilar is Hermincutes, which is hard for gain energy and food digestion. Meanwhile, the most abundant bacterial genus are Cytobacterium and Acromancia. Cytobacterium um, help in production of vitamin B12 and Acromancia help to improve the immune system. Previous presented data shows catish butter affinis more diversity compared to the wild sample. Because of what? Influenced by diet and also water most money. So stand water easily to bacteria to grow up. Okay. Uh, this study also found several probiotic bacteria, namely Cetobacterium, Bacteroides, Acromancia, Sarcina, Levobacterium, and Cellulosilipicum. And two pathogenic bacteria found from this research, which is Parabacteroides, can cause digestive diseases, and also Clostridium botulinum can cause botulism on animal and humans. In conclusion, our study indicate Batagra affinis affinis more bacterial diversity compared to the Batagor affinis at Rokmonis from Kuala Barandrunganu. And we suggest uh, to, to have a good record keeping and daily observation, uh, especially for Batagor affinis captive management to determine earlier uh, abnormalities or something. So for the research required to detect any uh, potential either the bacteria can spread among or between who's on earth and also uh, to see uh, the impact of dominant pylum proteobacteria and dominant genus Cytobacterium and our results also contribute to assist in developing a long-term management towards sustainability.
therefore this is some achievements from this study we successful publish this research in purity we also uh, got international coverage from selenium science we won uh, research excellence award because of this study we also got best paper award and we got nominated uh, for a young research award from this international microbiome and dynastic forum 2022 thank you Thank you so much for discovering my study. I'm very appreciated. Um, without you guys, I am nothing. So any question, you can ask me, keep in touch with me, okay? And maybe we can collaborate together after this. <laughs> Thank you, see you again.